I think in any city, when you first arrive, it's the buildings that affect you first. So you can see the buildings, the streets you walk down, that sort of thing. And that's what initially got me hooked in. But the real thing that kept me here in Newcastle was the people. And I think that if you took away all the people from Newcastle, it would just be a beautiful city. It's the same northern people and the same northern culture that I see over and over again. And so that's what I want to show people, that's what I want to tell people is the fact that the people in this area, the way their culture is developed is very much a community focus, very much togetherness, and that's what's kept me here. That's what I want to show people, and that's the passion I have. So I started Isles Tours um, in March 2013, and the reason I started Isles Tours was because I'd come to Newcastle seven years before. Instead of getting involved in all the student light, I, um, I got involved with local people. And the more and more I found out about Newcastle, the more and more I talked to them, learned about local culture, got involved in those sort of things, the more and more I fell in love with Newcastle. A lot of the time, I'd find people who really just didn't understand Newcastle as I understood it. So I thought, I want to show people the real Newcastle, show people what's actually here, and show people the northeast as well because this whole area is amazing. And so the more and more I spent time here, the more and more I got involved in this place, I wanted to actually show people the real Northeast, the place which has got these amazing people, these amazing characters, this, this rich history, and the also amazing culture that's here in the Northeast. The reason why someone should come on one of my tours is because I show people Newcastle and the Northeast as it actually is. So often people will have heard about the history of this location and that's a part of what Newcastle and the North East is. So the amazing coal mining, the amazing shipbuilding, but then also I want to build on that. I want to show them the additional things that have actually happened here. For instance, the fact that Newcastle produced 90% of the world's glass during the 1700s. The fact that Newcastle has this amazing rich culture with innovation, technology, and also people who have actually influenced world history from all the way back in the Anglo-Saxon period with the Venerable Bede, all the way through to the current period or the early modern period where you've got people like Lord Armstrong, Earl Grey, who changed the world in their times, right through to today where Newcastle is now becoming a location where people come here to study, where new technologies are invented, where there's an entirely new culture developing here of leading the world forwards. And in my tours, you have this organic movement through the history and through the culture and through the food and drink and through all of these different things here so that we just show you the layers of how Newcastle's developed over the years. My vision for Isles Tours is to see Isles Tours become a company that will cover the whole UK, where wherever you are in the country, wherever you are in the world, where you'll see how the basic levels of history and culture have all added together to become what you have today and where you're going in the future.